I believe in doing a wellness vision every three months. There are four quarters in a year, and basically it takes 120 days for your body to go through a full cell reproduction, longer as we age, because that process gets a little slowed down um, as we get older, but 120 days for your body to go through that full cell reproduction. So the old cells are being replaced by new cells. So three months is just a good number to put together your wellness plan and know what you want to accomplish, how you want to optimize your athleticism or your fitness or your nutrition or any of the areas that we've talked about. Remember, I reminded you at our first, I think, um, time we were together, there are 1,440 minutes in every day. Use them wisely and be intentional about them. That's why in my mission statement, it says living on purpose because there's so much of life that passes us by. And a wellness vision kind of helps you to get a hold of those minutes and really make them work for you. So wellness is not a destination. It's a way of life. But our personal wellness vision builds strong habits And those strong habits create strong behaviors, and it's those behaviors that create a healthy way of life. So we we write it down, we make it clear. So a written vision is going to help us to imagine the way forward to our intended destination. It evokes motivational energy that you're going to need to move yourself forward in the process of change. I can't wait to teach on um, the process of change, the trans theoretical model of change, which is pretty cool. And it connects us to our values and motivators so that we can clearly define those goals and action steps that we're talking about. And it creates intentional space. Intentional. There's that word I use a lot because we've got to be intentional and having that intentional space, just like my uh, reviewer, one of my clients that I read um, his review to you, is intentional space for self-awareness, personal growth, and those positive outcomes. So wellness vision is just a tool, but we have to choose our tools because we choose the tools that shape our lives.